Alright guys, here's a new flying wing that I built and I've been flying recently and been having a lot of fun with. Um, so this is one of the few airplanes that I've ever purchased. You purchase it as a kit and assemble it. It's called the Grim Reaper by Crash Test Hobby. And this plane is awesome. It's made out of EPP foam that you put together and laminate. It's got carbon, or sorry, uh, fiberglass spars in here that it comes with and you assemble. This plane's great. They actually use these planes for full contact air combat. I mean, I've seen guys nose these planes into the ground straight 90 miles an hour, like 80 miles an hour. They literally just bounce and you throw it back up in the air. Extremely, extremely crash resistant. This foam is just, can put up with anything. So this is my version of it. Um, you just kind of, you get it, it comes in two wing halves. You glue the halves together, you put in the spars. They're in like an A shape in here. You laminate it, put in your servos and everything else. These servos are 9 gram T Pro servos, but metal gear, and they work great for this. Maybe a little bit weak, but you know, I really haven't had any problems with them. This is a C3530 1700 kV motor. It's not going to focus there with a 7x6 prop. Really, really fast, really, really efficient. I have a 40 amp ESC spectrum gear in here. I think this is like an AR6210 and I run this with a 3000 milliamp hour nanotech and this plane is great it comes with a shaped airfoil which you know what I usually make my KFM airfoils just because they're easy to make at home but man this has really changed my view on shaped wings because this plane flies great it can just glide forever you cut the power and it just glides. I mean you have to literally force this thing down out of the air. It's a lot of fun to fly. It's really agile, really fast, and I've been having a ton of fun with this. My plan for this wing in the future is to uh, fly FPV with it. And it's great because the foam here, you can just cut out whatever you need and move stuff around. So you can completely customize everything here for what you're going to use this wing for. So I'm going to go out and fly now with it and I'll show you guys some of that footage. Now this is a large plane, but so light you can just throw it like that and get it going. I just hit it turned on the motor right there at the very end. It was just gliding. Now this plane has a lot of speed. With that 1700 kV motor, it really gets going. And a lot of these shots, the motor's off and it's just cruising by. Once it gets speed, it just glides forever. I think this would be really fun with the FPV gear. Just take it up high, turn off the motor, and just let this thing cruise down. You can see there, look how high it got up. Just cruising there. It has plenty of power and strength, and I just nose dive it there. I think as long as you can keep the weight down, this would be a really, really great FPV platform. And apparently, it's great for aerial combat. These guys hit each other going really fast and don't hurt these planes at all. This plane's also very maneuverable. It has large control surfaces for its size and has a lot of speed as you can see. It's almost, it's really hard to land this thing just because it wants to keep gliding. It's hard to get it down on the ground. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe.